everybody and welcome back. So today we are going to be doing a little kit. This is the super duper bubblegum lab. It includes lots of flavors like watermelon, orange, and just the classic bubblegum. Okay, so if we look on the back, we've got lots of stuff. We have gum base, powdered sugar, corn syrup, bubblegum flavor, watermelon flavor, and orange flavor. It even comes with these little sheets for our custom bubblegum wrapping. Okay, let's open this up. Okay guys, here we go. This is what's inside the kit. Of course it comes with a manual because dumb people like me don't know how to make gum. Of course, this is my first time, so I am super excited, but whoa, there's a lot of pages. Wow. Anyway, I guess I'll start reading. Before I hit you in the face with this book, this item will be linked in the description if you would like to purchase. Okay guys, there we go. I am finally done reading this book. I know how to make it, I'm all ready. Here's how you do it. Okay, so here's all the things that you're going to be needing. Your gum base, corn syrup, bubble gum flavor, gum wrapping stickers, and your powdered sugar. As well as your wax paper, measuring cup, ruler, and fork and knife. Okay, first start by taking both your packets of corn syrup and let them marinate in hot water. Once they're all hot, open up the packet. and empty it out into the measuring cup. This should be a little less than half a cup. Right when you're done that, empty it out into the bowl so then it's easier to microwave. Put it aside, grab a larger bowl, and all of your gum base. Cut that open as well. Take a tablespoon and add two of those in. This should be two tablespoons. Then add one cup of warm water just to cover over top of all the gum base. Then take your plate and a bit of your powdered sugar and empty out around five tablespoons onto your plate. back aside. Use your hands to make it like a little mountain like this. Then poke a little hole so then you can put the gum base mixture in a bit later. Okay, so bring back your gum base and put that in the microwave for 30 seconds. Bring it out and use a fork to just knead it around a bit. Put it back in again. Bring it out. Keep kneading it around and putting it back in for different intervals until it looks like this. You should keep on kneading it together until it starts to grab onto each other. Once it's all kneaded together, bring back your corn syrup and add it in. Once all that's added in, grab your bubblegum mixture and put that in too. Then start mixing it around until it starts to cling onto each other. There we go, it's all mixed up. Bring back your powdered sugar and empty out your mixture right on top. Add it right on top of your powdered sugar, put the bowl aside, and then start kneading in with your hands to make it less sticky and to bring all the flavor together. it's a lot less sticky like this, start molding it into a big long snake so you can cut it up into pieces for your gum. Once it's rolled out nicely like this, use your ruler to measure and cut the gum into equal pieces. Hey, we're all done the mixture. They're all molded out. Now we're going to make the wrapper. So you're gonna take your wax paper. We are going to cut out seven different rectangles. That is three inches by four inches. Here we go. Okie dokie, I got all of my seven sheets. So here's how you wrap them. I'm gonna take one of our sheets, place down the gum right in the middle, 
fold it over like this. There, hold it like that. Twirl the sides up a bit. Now for the other side. Take one of your little stickers here and place it around like this. Amazing, now it's like these little candies. Now let's wrap them all up. Anyway guys, that was so much fun. I had so much fun making the little wrappers, making the candy. This was an amazing little project. I do recommend you try it for yourself and buy the kit. I will leave the link to this box below in the description. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you on the next one. Woo!